you get some air TV coming in, you know, over, you get 4K, 8K, and 1080p on your TV set. How cool is that? I need to review this uh, ant top antenna. Hey guys, this is Joe Tech from Joe Tech Tips We're on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Today we have this ant top uh, antenna for your house if you want to get air TV. You know what I'm talking about? This kind of stuff is kind of interesting. You, you, this is a tabletop model so you can stick it on top of your desk or next to your television set. So if you wanted to get some air TV like a free TV uh, so you don't need to have any cable connected to your uh, uh, you don't need like optimum online or uh, what well, that's not what I'm talking about you don't need to have you know cable boxes connect to television you just have one of these bad boys connected and then you get some air TV coming in you know over you get 4k 8k and 1080p on your TV set how cool is that we're gonna do unboxing of this gosh darn thing and see what's in inside this box. So you don't have to screw on the antennas on this one? So I'm assuming without taking this thing apart, it's identical to the white one except shorter. And it still offers the same type of base. So the other antenna only got um, five channels, which I think is so stupid. I mean, what's the point? Even though I got these, both of these antenna 100% free. If they work, then I'll boast them. But if they don't work, I'm not going to boast it. You know what I mean? Five channels is shit. Why would you... I mean, you guys are aware that Pluto TV, you could stream. There's no way. You know, this thing has to be up like 4,000 feet <laughs> in order to get, you know, to be able to have 80 mile range. The signal has to penetrate and hit everything. So this is a receiving antenna. So the bigger the antenna, obviously, the better it is. But I'm not, you know, it. it we've already did this review of the other, the, the larger Big Brother. I can't imagine this. If this gets the same amount of channels, five, 55.1, 55, oh, 55 55.1 to 55.5, or 55.6, whatever it was. Uh, um, I'm not overly impressed. And this one we're going to try. Um, well, this is interesting. So this you have to use as cable. So this has a female, a male end on this, and you need to use a female. So that's stupid. Why would you do that? Why would they end up doing that? So you have to use... Oh, God, these people are so stupid. <laughs> I don't get it. Why would you do that? You need the other end. And then this, this add a barrel connected to this so you can actually... So you don't need to convert. So now I have to unravel this cable to use it on the on the TV. That's a stupid, stupid thing. You know what I'm talking about? I don't understand what the hell they did here. This gosh darn stupid. So now we're going to take this antenna and stick it on the television set inside, which is a, a, a 65 inch LG television set. We're going to do air TV. We're going to do a scanning of channels and we'll see what this thing can do. We'll be right back. Options. Here we go. Scan for channels. I have an antenna. Search for channels. No need for that. Scanning antenna. So now we're going to... <laughs> this, is, this is a gosh darn shame, people. So we already did this on the other antenna and it found five channels. We put the baby brother antenna on it and it can't... It can't even see the channels it found. So this is going way too quick. The other scan yesterday went a hell of a lot slower. So I'm having a funny feeling that this is... So we don't need to scan any cable TV because we don't have anything on that. So we're skipping cable TV. Cancel. No channels were found. <laughs> oh my God. This is terrible. So let's... Let's turn on the booster. Let's see if it actually... So that's without the booster turned on. So let's let's scan again. So this is terrible. 
and, and this is designed for this type of use. That's why there's a stand on it. There's a stand on it for a reason. It's right there. That's the antenna. And we're getting nothing. See, does it find anything? You know, we want to skip the cable TV because we don't need that. We just need air TV. Let's see what happens. No channels were found. Okay, this review is done. So, I got to find the closest garbage pail for this thing. They did a lot of work and design on the box. It looks really pretty. However, it works. It doesn't work. Biggest piece of shit I've ever seen. Oh my god. Well, the other one's the biggest piece of shit I've ever seen because it got five channels and it's really big. Uh, even though I got these things for free, it doesn't really matter. They don't freaking work. It doesn't matter. I mean, come on. I'm not... You guys know me. If the product sucks, I will let you know. It's a shame. I was really hoping that this was going to do something fantastic. This one received nothing. Absolutely nothing. With the power booster off and with the power booster on, it did absolutely nothing. It didn't even receive the channels that the other one received, which was only five. So all that investment. Now, remember, it's a tabletop design. So it should work on the tabletop antenna right next to the TV, wherever you got to put it. It's also designed to put on a mast and everything like that. And we don't have that capability at the moment to test. And I'm not going to waste all my time if it can't even receive basic stuff. So this is an epic fail product. Unfortunately, this I wouldn't even go anywhere near this product, this particular one. The other one at least got five channels in the house. But... This one got nothing, zero. Epic fail. So guys, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Take care and we'll see you next time. Hey guys, this is Joe Tech, and I have a P.O. Box. If you want to send me some fan mail, hate mail, products you want me to review, that is, you know, you just want me to, to review the product with just without even telling me about it, you want to surprise the crap out of me, send it to Joe Tech Tips, P.O. Box 149, Selden, New York, S-E-L-D-E-N, New York, 11784. Can't wait to hear from you.